one. All right. Wow, well, early hit. Early hit, and it appears that's that it. Puck is just upside down. Yeah, unable to do anything. Yeah, I, I do not believe they have a self right mechanism. It's doing sort of this interesting vibration thing, but, you know, that only counts for so much. So unless it can turn itself over, yeah. it will be knocked out of this yeah. match. Hexadecimator is doing a little driving practice with what, is what he should be doing <laughs> with the arena time. The ref's count has begun. Yeah. Counting him down. Six. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Hex so Hexadecimator went for another hit, which... Yeah, wanted to extend the match so the, the count starts again. And he's well, now they're just having fun. They're playing yeah. with their food. Yeah, exactly. And yeah, Puck is yeah, righted. All right. So he's got Puck upright again. Very nice. Good sportsmanship. <laughs> just doing it again because he yeah. can. And Puck is such a brick with all the, the, the beating he's taken that's not doing any damage to the robot. Ooh. Is that is a double gainer? I'm going for him? up on my swim term. Yeah. He's got this. Yeah. And you can see the dust flying in the air from that. Yeah, it's sort of interesting. We're getting this cloud effect. This is a new steel floor. Yeah. And to be honest with you, they haven't had time to clean it and paint it. So we're sort of, this is like sort of a San Francisco fog that has moved in on the arena. And now the question is, do they continue yeah. to play? Okay, we've got a minute and 18 second, seconds left. It's interesting with the dirt in the early days with Mark Thorpe. One of the th he really liked dirt. He really liked the visual effects of that. And so he sort of designed his arena to encourage that to happen, what we see happening here. Mark, is, Mark as people know, is the highly the regarded rest, founder of robot combat. The ref's count has completed. It looks like Hexadecimator uh, hexadecimated them. Yeah. Let's hear it for Hexadecimator. Yeah, yeah, kids. 54 seconds remaining. So this goes to show that it's a lot of these matchups are just going to come down to the different types of weapons, oh who yeah. can get underneath who. Yeah, yeah. And in this case, Hexadecimator yeah. was able to get underneath Puck and flip it uh, 